Hello, this is Logan Delay from Scientific Learning. Welcome to this presentation. I will be describing a study conducted in Western Australia to evaluate the use of fast-forward products for improving language and literacy skills. The study was conducted by educators at four primary schools in a major metropolitan area of Western Australia. Clinicians with Sonic Hearing, a local private practice, supported the educators with training and expert assistance in fast-forward implementation. Across the four schools, 144 students participated in the study. At the beginning and end of the study, the students' language and literacy skills were assessed by school personnel using a battery of tests from the Clinical Evaluation of Language Fundamentals, and the Queensland University Inventory of Literacy. The study was conducted using a randomized controlled trial design. Half of the students were randomly assigned to an intervention group, and only the students in this group used the fast-forward product during the study. The remaining students were assigned to a control group. Students in the control group did not use the fast-forward products until after the study. Research evaluators, such as the What Works Clearinghouse, considered this type of study to provide strong evidence about an intervention's effectiveness. The randomized control trial design is also known as a gold standard study. The intervention group used the fast-forward products for an average of nine weeks, typically working 50 minutes per day, five days per week. Most of the students used two fast-forward products, starting on fast-forward language or fast-forward middle and high school, and then advancing to fast-forward language to reading. This graph will show how the two groups fared on the test battery in terms of the three primary composite scores. Receptive language is the ability to understand language when listening or reading. Expressive language is the ability to effectively use language for speaking or writing. Phonological awareness is the ability to think about the sounds of language, a critical early reading skill. For all three scores, the blue bars show the average gains made by the control group. The red bars show the average gains made by the fast-forward group. Scores from the test battery were combined for statistical analysis. The results of this analysis showed that, on average, the students who used fast-forward made significantly greater language and literacy gains than the students who did not. These results suggest that using the fast-forward products strengthened the students' foundational skills and better positioned them to benefit from the classroom curriculum. Thank you for your time. If you have any questions, feel free to contact our customer service team.